Well, good afternoon, Mendocino County Public Servants. I'm Carmel Angelo, Mendocino County Chief Executive Officer, and this is actually one of the, the last moments that I will say that. I wanted to speak with you today just to take a few minutes to number one, thank you for all of your service to Mendocino County, whether this is your first day or whether this is your eighth year or 20th year. I wanna thank you for the service that you have given to Mendocino County, to the Board of Supervisors, and to the 90,000 residents that live in this county. I have been here in Mendocino County for 15 years. I have served as your Chief Executive Officer for 12 plus years. For those of you that don't know me, I came from Southern California and I started in Mendocino County as the Health and Human Services Director. And then two and a half years later, I moved into the Assistant CEO position and five months later to CEO. It has been a wild ride, I have to say. There have been a lot of ups and downs but I thank uh, you and the board and the community uh, every day for being able to serve. It has been an honor and a pleasure to serve Mendocino County. Over the last 12 years, I think the biggest issue that I've dealt with as CEO and that you have dealt with as a Mendocino County employee has been the budget, has been the lack of resources, and how we continue to serve and to provide more and improved services. I think it has been uh, challenging for all of us and certainly there have been a few rough years. But today is a new day and uh, our hope is that we will continue to provide resources to our greatest assets. And those great assets are you, our employees. So again, I would like to thank you for the work you do. I would also like to remind everyone that there have been some services that we have tried to provide to our employees over the last few years. And I would ask you, if you have not been involved in the leadership initiative or have information about the leadership initiative, that you ask your coworkers or you ask your supervisor or your department head or you call human resources and get that information. One of the things that I'm most proud of over the last 12 plus years is the Leadership Initiative and the 40 people that began the Leadership Initiative and where we are today. And I would like to thank those employees that began the Leadership Initiative and are still with it and are assuring that the Leadership Initiative is something that all of our staff, incoming staff, hear about. It's a benefit to you to participate. It's also a benefit to participate in our CSAC courses. What we've been able to do even through COVID and through our lockdown has been to offer CSAC Institute courses and, and a credential to our employees. And I'm very pleased that we've been able to do that. We don't have an organization full of county employees. We have an organization full of public servants. When you come into this county, you learn about public service and I hope every single day you continue to learn about public service. The other thing I want you to remember is a phrase that I like to use, step up, step out, and stay engaged. And I ask you to consider that. Step up when you can. Take on a little bit more when you can. And I know everybody, everybody is doing that. Whether you're a department head or whether you're a staff assistant, everyone is taking on more. But I would ask you, as we move forward in the world that we live in and work in today, continue to step up and continue to step out. Don't be afraid to come up with a new idea and to share that new idea. That's why you're here. And stay engaged. I would tell you what I tell the community. Keep watching. Watch government. Watch what we're doing. Be participatory. That's your job when you work in government and just as a private citizen. Do your civic duty, stay engaged. If you see something you don't like, ask about it, comment on it. If you see something you do like, comment on it. So step up, step out, and stay engaged. The Board of Supervisors is very interested in the adoption of the strategic plan. The board hired consultants. They've been working within the county system, getting information and putting together a strategic plan. 
The goal of that strategic plan is to carry Mendocino County government into the future. So I hope you have all participated. If you haven't participated, I would ask that you talk with your supervisor or your department head and see if you could still review the strategic plan, do an interview, or give comments. That strategic plan should move Mendocino County into the future. And finally, I would just like to say again that I thank you for all of the work that you've done in Mendocino County. I thank you for the opportunity to serve as the Chief Executive Officer for this county. It has been a pleasure. And uh, again, it's been a challenge for all of us every single day. But clearly, uh, I appreciate the opportunity. And it is uh, time for me to go. Uh, I'm retiring. I'm returning back to Southern California to live near my family. So I'm looking forward to that. So again, thank you, thank you, thank you. Keep up all the good work that you've been doing.